Hi everyone, this is Dave and welcome to a new video on the Geek and Noise channel. In today's video, I'm going to be giving you my review of a laser printer from Brother. This is the HL L3210CW. It's a color laser printer and I've been using it for around about sort of week and a half, two weeks now. And I've been impressed so far. It's been working very well for me. I'm going to show you it in action very shortly. Uh, before I do so, a few little bits of housekeeping to do. Just to let you know that Brother are a channel sponsor. They do sponsor the Geek and Noise channel. But all of my opinions about this printer are my own. And if anything doesn't work as expected, as always, I'll be completely transparent with you and let you know. Also, this is a live broadcast. So if you want to leave me any questions or comments in the live chat, please do. You can also use the super chat, of course, if you want your question or comment highlighted. And if you're watching this after the live broadcast, you can use the main comment section below. One last thing, if you are new to the channel, please do hit that subscribe button and also hit the notification bell. That way you get to know when I go live. Anyway, because this is live, let's take a look inside the live chat. We've got Shoeb Nasir. Thanks for tuning in again, Shoeb. I really do appreciate it. Also, Rob Maguire. Good morning to you. Maurizio Garcia, Golden Solution, and Jin Zhang. Thank you very much for tuning in. I really do appreciate each and every one of you. So anyway, I think we should get on with a look at this particular uh, laser printer. Um, sort of, when I look at printers nowadays, there are mainly sort of two categories. There are people that used to print out a lot of photos back in the day when inkjet printers and photo printers were all of the rage. And then it seemed to taper off as smartphones gained in popularity. We don't print our photos out a lot nowadays. And then there's this second category of uh, users that still use a printer uh, for creating business documents, reports, uh, letters, uh, any sort of document that we're going to bind to do some sort of presentation and sort of general office work and a lot of people work from home as well so there is still this need for a really good quality printer and this particular laser printer fits into the more compact category and I just can't wait to show you it so let's take a closer look at the printer itself so this is the Brother HL L3210CW and it comes with toners pre-installed. It comes with like a toner value pack, and it's a really nice compact design. The small print on uh, small footprint on this is really very very good indeed. Uh, I've got a couple of printers on this particular desk, and it, it accommodates this one very very nicely. Uh, the print speeds on this are up to 18 pages per minute. They come out of this top section here and lay flat face down on the top of the printer. And then there's also this little flap that you can pull down just so that if you're printing multiple pages, they don't shoot off of the, of the top of the printer. It sort of just captures them nicely there. If we open this up, we can see the layout of the toner cartridges. Uh, so we've got the black toner cartridge at the back and then cyan, magenta and yellow. Uh, and these have got uh, a couple of different options when you're replacing these. You can go for a standard one or a higher yield toner cartridge as well. There's also this uh, front input. So if you're putting in slightly thicker media or some sort of different media, perhaps uh, a laser printer compatible uh, thicker stock or maybe a laser compatible uh, label, then you can use this front paper feed tray. And then if we look down the bottom, We've got the really large paper capacity tray and this takes up to 250 sheets of A4 paper. Uh, you can put different size paper in here as well. You can move the uh, sort of guides in and out, uh, but primarily you're going to probably be using this for A4 paper. Now around the back we have got USB connectivity, but this also connects wirelessly as well. So we've got a, a wireless connection. So we can print from pretty much any device, including laptops, uh, mobile phones or smartphones and tablets. There's a, a one line LCD display. Uh, this is used for setting up the printer and for feedback on the status. And let's take a look at it printing because I printed out some sheets for you to have a look at as well. The printing is very, very fast. Uh, it's got a really nice processor inside and also 256 megabytes of memory. So it's a you know good turn of speed when it's printing out. I think the 18 pages per minute at this price point is very, very acceptable. Now, this is like a business type document 
you're going to be printing out a report combination of photos and text the text is very very crisp indeed I'll be taking a closer look at these prints with you in a short while uh, the photos very very good and for this type of business presentation document I think you'll be very very uh, impressed very happy with this type of printer uh, so let's print something else out uh, we're going to take a look at perhaps some just some photos uh, which isn't what this printer's designed for but it still does uh, quite a convincing job of printing out a full A4 page photo and the difference between a laser printer and an inkjet printer is that this is using toner rather than wetter ink so when the page comes out you can touch it straight away you've got very little crinkle to the page uh, if that was printed out that one you just saw if that was printed out on an inkjet printer uh, you'd have to use a really good quality paper otherwise the page would be quite sort of soggy uh, and then this one here you can see this photo is okay on the foreground the background it has got some sort of weird effect in the background and but as I, I really should reiterate this really isn't for printing out photos it's more for business documents but overall the design of the printer is very very nice indeed and I think overall it does just a fantastic job at these sort of multiple page documents now during that demonstration I showed you some of the printouts and I just want to talk about them a little bit more so this is what I would say is like a business presentation document a combination of uh, a graphic photo uh, could be a pie chart some sort of chart uh, or illustration and text the actual photos when they're at this smaller size sort of half page and smaller absolutely spot on it creates a very effective presentation document and the text is very very crisp indeed as you would expect from a laser printer but the the brother laser printers really do produce really nice crisp clear text and this was a, a multiple page document that I printed and the speed the 18 pages per minute Whilst well, not the fastest, you've got to remember that this is one of the more entry-level laser printers from Brother. And 18 pages per minute is a good turn of speed. Very, very quick indeed. And as you go up the range, in fact, I've left a link down below to the Brother uh, website. As you go up the range, then you obviously get faster print speeds. But I think 18 pages per minute for sort of a, a small home office environment, or even a small sort of office environment, or medium size even, is more than acceptable. Uh, when you go into sort of a, a medium size office or a larger office with multiple users, then I would probably look further up the range for something with uh, Ethernet or network connectivity. But the fact we've got USB and wireless uh, makes this uh, a, a very sort of good choice. So business documents, absolutely brilliant. Now I want to show you that last photo first. Uh, this one here had some uh, sort of blurred out background and um, you can see the foreground subject where it's in focus very nice indeed but we have got some sort of effect going on here so if you're looking for something with for subtleties in photos this is not the right choice you know it's not a photo printer there's no denying that fact uh, if you want a photo printer get a dedicated photo printer your running costs will be a lot higher admittedly uh, but that is not what this is designed for uh, but this photo here I think it did a very good job of uh, this is the iPhone 10s Max and the Apple Watch Series 4 both of which I've covered on the channel and I think this photo looks more than good enough a very very nice photo it's picked up all of the detail in my desk here uh, so I was really pleased with how it sort of produced this very very good indeed so overall the actual quality of this printer I think is top notch it's got some great features built in it's uh, fairly economical to run as well as I mentioned you can choose between I might stand corrected on this but I'm sure that when I checked you can get sort of a standard toner cartridge and then a high yield one as you can with most laser printers uh, the paper handling love the fact it's got that large 250 sheet paper tray and I really do like the compact design on this the footprint on it is nice and small so it's nice and easy to manage uh, nice and easy to com accommodate on a desk uh, I didn't demonstrate the sound of the laser printer laser printers when they're working you can obviously hear them in the working environment uh, it's no louder or no quieter than, than other laser prints I've tested so in closing if you are going to be printing out lots of documents lots of business presentations a combination of graphics and text and you want really crisp clear printouts then I can certainly recommend this one from brother this is the brother HLL3210CW 
please do check out the links down in the video description area to where you can pick this up for yourself. Thanks very much for tuning in, everyone. I've seen uh, also fellow fielder and Marlinia Mosley tuning in. I really do appreciate you coming into the live broadcast and the live chat. Don't forget to check out those links. And if you enjoyed this video, please do hit that like button. Thanks very much for watching. I'll see you in another video very soon.